Testing rough diamonds at home can help you get an initial idea of whether your stone might be real before seeking professional verification. While these home methods are not a substitute for laboratory testing, they are simple, quick, and can give you strong clues about authenticity. Here are five reliable ways to test rough diamonds at home. Our one, the hardness scratch test. Real diamonds are one of the hardest natural materials on earth. How to test, use a piece of glass or a ceramic tile and gently try to scratch it with the stone. A real rough diamond will scratch the surface easily. Fake stones like quartz or calcite will not leave a mark. Note, do not use metal objects to scratch the diamond. This method tests if the diamond scratches other materials, not the reverse. Now from two, the fuff. Diamonds conduct heat extremely well. How to test? Breathe warm air on the stone until it fogs up. A real diamond defogs instantly, less than a second. A fake stone stays foggy for two, four seconds or longer. This simple test helps differentiate diamond from glass or cubic zirconia. Three. The saltwater float test diamonds have a high density. How to test, mix water with a large amount of table salt until it dissolves completely. Drop the stone in the water. Real rough diamonds will sink. Many fake stones will float or sink very slowly. If the stone floats, it is almost certainly not a diamond. Four, light reflection sparkle test. Even in rough form, diamonds have a distinct way of reflecting light. How to test? Place the stone under a bright light. Real diamonds produce white light brilliance and subtle rainbow flashes, fire. Fake stones show more exaggerated rainbow colors or appear dull. Use a phone flashlight or direct sunlight for best results. Number five, conductivity test, aluminum foil or simple tester. Diamonds conduct electricity better than most gemstones. How to test? Use a simple at-home diamond tester or wrap the stone in aluminum foil and touch it with the tester's probe. Real diamonds usually show high conductivity. Simulants like glass, quartz or CZ have low conductivity. While inexpensive testers are not perfect, they offer useful confirmation. Final advice, these tests can help you make an initial judgment, but only a gemologist can confirm authenticity with 100% accuracy. If your stone passes several of these tests, consider taking it to a professional lab for final evaluation.